The Federal Open Market Committee concluded a two-day meeting earlier today. As you already know from our statement, the committee decided today to keep the target range for the federal funds rate at zero to one-fourth percent and to make no change in either its asset purchase program or its forward guidance regarding the federal funds rate target. The committee is continuing its highly accommodative policies. As you know, in normal times, the committee eases monetary policy by lowering its target for the short-term policy interest rate, the federal funds rate. However, the target range for the federal funds rate currently at zero to one-fourth percent cannot be lowered meaningfully further. Because the committee tied its asset purchases to the outlook for the labor market, it's important to assess how that outlook has evolved. As I noted earlier, conditions in the job market today are still far from what all of us would like to see. Nevertheless, meaningful progress has been made in the year since we announced the asset purchase program. The Fed is still not fully confident that the expansion of the U.S. economy um, is on a self-sustaining basis, that the economy still needs this kind of stimulus. I think that a lot of investors were pleased that the Fed did not begin its tapering program because while they believe that the economy is improving, they don't really feel that it's strong enough to stand on its own two feet. I think that today's response also was an indication that the likely successor to Fed Chairman Bernanke in Janet Yellen would be equally responsive to the data.